Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video I'm going to check this new inline voltage alarm from Lantern RC. You've probably encountered this problem before where you lost the quad in a field and the battery was detached from the quadcopter and you couldn't find your quadcopter using the buzzer that is located on board. So this accessory helps to solve this problem. The device itself is pretty light. It weighs 10.37 grams. The length is about 37.2 millimeters and the width is about 14 millimeters. Operating this voltage alarm is done by simply connecting first your battery. And then you can select the voltage per cell the alarm is going to be triggered. You have four options, 3.4 volts, 3.5 volts, 3.6 volts and 3.7 volts and you can switch it by simply short pressing this button over here. The alternative of course is to use one of these buzzers but the problem is that using this balance connector is not as steady as using the XT60 connector and this buzzer is more prone to be detached from the battery on a crash. So if you're going to connect this device to your quadcopter and then to your battery I think it's going to be a little bit more durable. In terms of weight, the weight is very similar. I think this device can be ideal for a quadcopter that doesn't have an onboard buzzer and if you want to fly it line of sight so you can hear it because this buzzer is not very loud. For example, this buzzer is much louder. I'm going to connect a battery with a very low voltage to trigger the alarm and to show you the difference. So this buzzer is very, very loud as you can hear. And now I'm going to connect this buzzer. Because this device only measures the aggregation of the voltage, it, was, it won't be triggered when it's set to 3.4 volts. So for example, with this unbalanced battery, the, the alarm will be triggered only when it's set to 3.7 volts. Now the alarm is being triggered. And you can hear that this buzzer is much louder than this buzzer. Because so of course the reason that my depleted battery didn't trigger this alarm is because it's getting only the total voltage of the battery and then split it by cell. So because the total voltage was over 3.4 volts per cell, it didn't trigger the alarm. So I think what Lunch RC should improve for the next product is just to put a louder buzzer because I don't think this is loud enough and even if it's gonna fly it in short range, I'm not sure that you're going to hear it. So thank you for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it and it was useful for you. If you have any questions about this product, feel free to ask it in the comment section below and see you on my next videos. Goodbye.